a lot of people in the blue uniforms, a few in brown uniforms. Everybody seems to be yelling at each other, uh, making noise, creaking wheels, lots of construction. It's a huge din. There's also various small water towers on buildings here and there. Um, wide streets, narrow alleys. Uh, the furries walk on the sides, leaving the middle open for horses, carts. Also, their horses are kind of like a, a lizard type of horse thing. And they shit everywhere. Um, <laughs> let's see. And everybody seems good with Australians and shit, which they believe you guys are all Australians for some reason. You don't know what the fuck is going on. There's a lot of scaffolding on buildings. Uh, looks like a lot of new uh, construction is going on. And eventually he takes you into, like, the area gets worse and worse. You pass a tower that seems to be on fire. Nobody cares. And <laughs> into, uh, uh, like, big smelters, lots and lots of smelters. And he takes you guys to uh, a lizard that's a bit larger than a Komodo dragon that looks at him and goes, so you're back. Yeah, teach me fucking fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have this energy roll for lizard talking? Uh, actually, for some reason, your brain feels like it's kind of like you've been given drugs and you're kind of free-floating a little bit, so you're not too disturbed by things, which is weird. And I, 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 would, suspicious. I, I would totally love to learn some fire magic. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, I'll make you the same deal as I made the others. Bring me back a new hobby. He does not have humanish hands. He is a lizard. Can you play a harmonica? Not worth a shit. I have no hands for that, he says. Okay. I can teach you how to make they, they, the, they have the neck things. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> his other two hobbies, uh, let's see, one of them is he does the thing with the hot metal because he puts it in his mouth because he's a fire lizard and he burns the wood with it. And what was his other one? Uh, painting. painting, right. They've got a mouth paint brushes that are uh, resistant, and he's wearing an asbestos uh, sweater. Do you want to learn how to lip read? That's not a hobby. <laughs> you want to learn meat sculpting? Uh, that's not a proper hobby. Oh, uh, okay. It's no, I hobby. mean, you, I want to learn a proper hobby. Wait, mimicry? That's not a hobby. <laughs> I have enough trouble talking with a mouth like this as it is. What are you people? Cartography. You're a, you already can paint. That's Why not paint hobby. maps? Oh, well. Uh, that is a big hobby. Uh, uh, he looks grumpy. <laughs> Doesn't, you don't like that one? I don't care if you can do it or not. Bring me back something so I can start another hobby. Cooking. Yeah. Uh, you would to... say you like you're on crack. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get him a hang glider. <laughs> he looks interested. He doesn't know what that is. Yeah, we could strap you into a hang glider. That Go might be on. fun. Go on. Uh, okay, well, what you do is you, you, you have a big wing, and you have a harness, and you, you get into the harness, and then you jump off... Uh, a tree or a cliff or something, and you can right. fly. You can fly. I can fly? Yeah, you can fly with a hang glider. You bring that to me, I'll teach both of you. Yeah. All right. Cool. I, yeah. but I, I think you might be more suited to hot air ballooning. I think that might be more your thing. You already got the fire down. Something that uses fire? Yeah. And do I still fly? You still fly. Yes, you still fly. Yeah, bring me, a, bring me one of those then. <laughs> okay, we'll bring him a hot air balloon. Thanks. <laughs> I think that would be easier to find nowadays than or in this. They time do have a barrage. Room. They do have a barrage balloon up above the city, but it definitely looks military. You notice that Alex is giving you a look. What, what's wrong with us, Alex? It doesn't seem to be a happy look. <laughs> Hi, Alex. <laughs> He's drinking in a grumpy fashion. Hang, hang gliding would have been fun. We, we, whichever we find easier. Well, I think he wants a balloon now, which um, is a little Sorry bit harder, a little bit harder to get. I would think. I would think since they don't 
really have any way to make aluminum in this time frame, I wouldn't think, if we're going mm -hmm. off of realism, mm -hmm. that a hot air balloon, which actually that technology already exists in this time frame, would be easier. Okay. <laughs> uh, while you guys are off trying to figure out what <laughs> technology exists in this time period, he's going to try to teach Alex uh, fire. First is fire. Do we, no, no, do, 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 do. What hobby did you teach him, Alex? Fencing. Fencing? <laughs> painting. Painting. Oh, painting. He's wanting to give the brushes. Hilarious. Uh, I'm looking for this guy's fucking stats because trying to figure out there's a hoy. A hoy sucks ass at this. And <laughs> what's the lizard's name? Salamander. Hmm. Oh, uh, he's with Burn Bear, I bet. Burn Yeah, she's the one who owns the place. Oh, yeah. Um and she hates being called. No, of course she's not there. Oh, wait. No, I know where he's at. I know where he's at. Interesting places. Uh, shit area. Mm, smelters. Right. He missed his fucking teaching. So, there you go. His name is Veeks. 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 Uh, I want to try and find a seamstress to make myself a balloon. No problem. Yes, you find a seamstress who... Uh, oh, shit, they want money for things? God yeah, they do. Yeah. And I don't think uh, we have Australian dollars here. I open up my pocket and I show them my very modern gun, if that exists. What? We have our modern semi-automatic pistols from Red, Land, Red Carpet Land. You brought that with you? It's in my holster. Okay, so you've been walking around with a pistol the whole time. Yeah, why not? Okay. Well, he says, I uh, don't know much <laughs> about guns. I can give you double what normal guns worth for it. Is that enough to make a balloon? Oh, God, no. <laughs> no, that'd be like $40. All right, I want to go to a gunsmith and try and sell my gun. He goes, ah, an Australian weapon. I recognize this. Uh, yeah, we don't. Uh, we're still working on getting the ammo from. Uh, um, uh, Joshua McKay and stuff like that in. So pretty much this would be uh, just an odd odd gun and that has no ammo in the meantime. I'll give you a triple what a normal gun goes for. 120. How much would I... Oh, I didn't ask him how much 60. the balloon would get. Or 60. Yeah, sorry. There you go. Don't triple 40. He gives you $60 I'll, for I'll your take the $60. dollars gun. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! It's essentially free in red carpet land. Cause okay. You still haven't told us if we have to pay back the credit cards or not. You're not we really sure. Get, as far as we didn't know. get guns with credit cards, Jeremy. Uh, we got that with cash at a gun show, dude. You, you, oh, you don't pay. Did. You don't pay with a credit card for a gun. Yeah, <laughs> cash advances on credit cards are pretty easy too. Yeah, until they cut you off, they are. Cut off. They haven't cut me off yet, as far as I know. Well, That's you may find bucks. out soon. Woo! All right, I got All right. Uh, are these dollars. are these specific Aussie dollars or no? No, uh, they they seem to have a, a constipated lion on one side and oh, okay. uh, two pears on the back, and it says "All hail Genovia." Genovia bucks. Genovia, Genovia. I got some Genovia bucks. Wait, is Anne Hathaway around? Take a card for knowing you're Genovian. Uh, <laughs> um, yes. Mm. Is uh, the castle loading? Looking up at the castle. The giant fort thing? Yeah. Yes. Is it like a like here? Like is the the do like a flag at like half mast if the if the monarch is in. Uh the monarch is most definitely not in right now. Yeah. Yes, I know. Uh, but I right. So you sold your thing, you've gotten some money, and you begin to hear uh bells and sirens and stuff in the distance. Ooh. And then it's taken up by things here in the fortress. I wanna I still or, wanna talk to, the, I'm still talking to the gunsmith guy. 
He's like busy closing up his door and ignoring you. He's like, well, time to go. I can make you some bullets. Hey, that's great. Why don't you come back tomorrow if we survive right. through the day? How's that, buddy? All right. <laughs> Sounds good. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> I think we're all going to die soon. If, if I'm still alive and you're still alive, we'll talk later. How's that? Yeah, great. Off you go. All so, right. So we run the hell out of here. <laughs> we're, 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 I hear panic. I don't hear direction. Uh, embassy. Um. Uh, Alex is is um, what what's Alex doing? I'm following Alex. Excellent. Well, <laughs> it, wherever Alex is going, if Alex is going somewhere, he knows this place. Yes. To the fort, I am going to command the attack from there. All right. All right. Go. Does anybody want an intimidate plus twenty? No. All right. You're dropping it. Here is a uh, generalized map of the town. Alex, where oh, would you like to take your new troops to? Right. I am going to take basically the very heart of the um, castle, the fort, like the where basically where the main um, uh, where the main um, like generals are going to be standing to like basically do the battle and then i'm going to stand i'm going to get there and go right right you guys you need to go on the front gate so you're going to send these two to where the front gate the l-shaped front gate oh okay no problem does it um, seem like a suicide mission no not at all you'll be fine um empathy <laughs> yes <laughs> i'm serious. i fail <laughs> Uh, by a quarter. Uh, you're thinking he's going to take great delight either way. It could be madly heroic. It could be suicidal. Could be anywhere in between. But he is happy with it. I'm rolling a tactics military. Ooh. Success. I got to check in that now. Woo. You're thinking that uh, it might be a while before they get to the big L-shaped gate. Uh, they'll probably have to go through the uh external walls first uh the walls around the downtown or the arco arcology all right okay. but it doesn't seem like a suicide mission a little tactics foul, military right? i guess i'll roll tech i guess i'll roll military tactics too since he's not telling me anything not to fail i blah oh <laughs> Yeah, it, it actually it seems like a rather safe place. If he sent you to the northern part of the arcology, that's probably a suicide mission. Okay. But he's keeping right. you relatively close to the fortress. If the fortress falls, whatever's attacking will not be a pretty thing. Okay. All right. Uh, man the gate. Gotcha. Thank man you, Alex. As well. Okay. Did you want them on the? Um, do we have weapons? <laughs> Cannons. Hmm? They... Ooh, sweet! <laughs> the look on Russ's face, like, are you on crack? No, I, I actually don't understand what he's saying. I... Cannons. 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 Yeah. Okay. We All are right. armed with cannons. <laughs> All right, then. Right. I'm, uh, I'm really good at that. Okay. Fire heavy weapon cannon. Yeah. Did you, did you want them on the uh, external L-shaped gate mat or the inside one? Uh, I want them on, like, they're going to go in the external and then uh, fall back to the internal if they need to. Oh, okay. So you're saying I'm like pretty much north of the downtown gate and then fall back to the ex external L shape yeah. and then the internal? Yeah. Okay, great. So you guys are pretty much at the point of the sword for the attack. All right. Great. And. Okay. Um, I spend most of my time trying to figure out what a good retreat route is. <laughs> No problem. It, it's literally through the town, and so since uh, if if anybody with military tactics knows that town fighting it sucks, yeah, success. It sucks a cock. It is the yes, worst it does. ever. Fail. <laughs> it is I think. where men are made. Little snipers everywhere. So we go into your dramatic combat. Dramatic combat. Dramatic combat. 
villains are first, heroes are second. Uh, each each hero select one piece of real gear and cross it off. You've already lost stuff. Apparently, mm. war is hell. Firing a grenade launcher is approved, if only. So the villains emerge from the forest. Uh, actually, first you hear a bunch of cracking and sticks breaking and stuff. And then you guys see a giant dragon missing its head and one of its feet come limping its ass out of the forests. Oh, my God. <laughs> and there's a lot of big shit that is getting ready to emerge from the forest, as well as hundreds of thousands of what appear to be really stick-thin figures dressed like they are mummies. And then after the mummy bandage, put on loose-fitting clothes on top of that. Hundreds of thousands of them. It's like watching pepper emerge from salt. It's not a happy day. Oh, boy. Cut to, it shows Alex and the general, like, we should have a shot first, but get this thing properly started. <laughs> um, are there any of those Old West rifles laying around? Sure. Can I get a rifle? Absolutely. I'll grab a rifle. You guys both grab rifles. That's, yep, that's on your round the bad guys are marching toward this and stuff we get eventually they're getting in basically you're going to have uh several shots with the cannon if you want because it will take them a while to go the couple of kilometers and cannons have a lot of range yeah right like villains are first heroes are second and may not use cards this round to get things done yeah. raising an eyebrow instead of doing any useful action is approved <laughs> Uh, so, Russ, you've, you've got several cannon shots. I'm just doing a few of them here if you're wanting to man the cannon. Uh, some There's a loading team for each of the cannons already in place. Basically, they need somebody to aim it and fire it. Okay. I'll get, I'll get my number done with. Uh, I take the shot. I drink it. Raise an eyebrow. That's good whiskey. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, card. So, Russ? Um, uh, can I assist him in I that? also raise an eyebrow. <laughs> and say, what the fuck is this? <laughs> Take a card. And sorry, Jeremy, what were you saying? I guess I'll raise an eyebrow too if he's not firing a cannon. Well, you can fire your own cannon. You can fire your cannon. Plenty of cannons here. Me firing a cannon would be a waste. Uh, be actually, a waste think, judging by what you're seeing other people doing, you're thinking not that big of waste. All right, I will fire yeah, a cannon. No. Why not? Does anybody want a Pulp Fiction fighter? No. Uh, you might want to keep hold of that. I would consider what? keeping hold of that. You might want to keep hold of that. Oh, actually, yeah. we're in combat. We can pull yeah. cards. You yeah. think? <laughs> yeah, you're in combat, all right. You need all the fighting cards you can get. Right. Okay, cool. So right. I take a card and I pull. I, I could pull the first card, right? At the yeah. end of each round is when you pull a card. So you should already have one pulled from the end of last round. Okay, so right. You see, you see uh, uh, Jeremy fires the cannon. The shell goes and it shows like a uh, like one of the huts out in the farmer's fields and stuff, and it explodes with a cannonball. And you see these three pig shaped or pig headed guys go ah fuck, and they're running over to a wooden hut. They run inside of there and slam the door. <laughs> Jeremy giggles at their misfortune. He is a bad man. <laughs> Next round. Heroes are first screaming in terror as you see. Uh, Oh, or sorry, villains are first. Uh, right, this round, everybody on the walls, i.e. you two, give me a Sandy roll as you see giant undead, which are approximately 30 meters tall, emerging from the forest. Success. Success. Yeah, so you, you don't even see it, Matt, but you can, you know, knock out your sand roll early. That's fine. Uh, it's one point toward uh, undead or zombies or whichever. Um, no problem. Uh, screaming and Terror is approved this round. Actually, there's a quite a few places you can go look out the window, Matt, and scream in terror if you wanted to. Or you'd scream in terror as you see the whiskey is getting low. No more whiskey. Ah! <laughs> this is the All kind right. of thing that the generals in this time period do actually do. So Right. I'm going to aim the cannon at um, one of the big undead things that just... Are they All right. 
Yep, it's it's an extreme range right now, so it's actually going to be counted as negative. Uh, but... Yang, sorry. Oh, everybody, discard all your cards. Fuck. Don't sorry. worry, you get new cards coming, uh, including pulled ones. All yeah. cards. None of them will be pulled anymore. It is the doom of all. The doom. Four. Draw. Nice. Way of nice. Oh, thank you very much. Well, there you go. Yeah. It's worked out well for someone. <laughs> All right. Okay. I don't. I just don't get it. Quite literally, I have a just don't get it card, and I just don't get it. Nice. I I, I don't get it. I don't understand the rules of the card. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, could you read it out loud? <laughs> Automatically fill your idea roll. I don't understand what that means. After five or more sand is lost, all of yeah, the uh, usual effects of sand. You don't do the fight flight freak thing. So that's I was what wondering what, what, I do, what do we do for end times five for for sanity loss? For for we'll what power, times, we'll power times three yeah. normally. Will power times three? Okay. Yeah. But uh, yeah, in this case, in this case, uh, you don't need to worry about uh, fight, flight, or freak if you play that card. Is what it means, Jeremy. Gotcha, gotcha. And so it only it will only kick in if you lose five or more Sam. All right. Beautiful. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try and find a closer target, maybe one of the dragons. Oh sure, there's a dragon. Everybody is shooting at the dragon a lot because they're like, ah, fail. No problem. The wooden uh, house gets blown the fuck up. The three pigmen immediately head into their last and final retreat. It's some sort of brick structure. So, um, <laughs> I, I attempt to shoot at not dragon. Fail. No problem. The brick structure is demolished and shit. I, some... uh, uh, I, I, um, I'm smoking a cigar with the officers. Mm -hmm. I just kind of flick the ash <laughs> by one of the cannons. <laughs> <laughs> Go All right, go for it. Yeah, give me a fire cannon roll as you... And, and you know what? Right. I will play Death God on that cannon. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I'm not running out of ammo. <laughs> <laughs> I am kill boring. Come on, cannon. No. Yeah. Neat. Yeah. Okay, so yeah... Uh, Pretty much, you can fire that cannon whenever you feel like it. It's your personal fucking bitch cannon. So, uh, right, everybody's firing a lot, missing even more. Next round, uh, defending's approved. Nobody's attacking you. Villains are hasted. Doesn't really help, and they shake their fucking weapons at you. You notice there's two different kinds of zombies. There's the slow ones that are like the fucking mess, and then there's fast ones that are moving around in there, and. People are yelling that the elves are attacking and stuff, so you're not sure what's up with that. Right. But apparently they're all undead is what undead or hidden elves. Crouching undead, hidden elf. That seems to be what they are. But people don't know which is which because they're all dressed the same. Right. <laughs> And there's about two dozen of the giant fucking undead things that are really amazingly fast. They're walking slow, but with legs that big, you cover a lot of fucking ground with each ponderous step. And they're all making their way to the fort. And they also seem to have more of these wrapped, hooded, cowled undead things clutching to them. Riding on shoulders, on the top of head, and even, spot hidden rolls from uh, you guys, Success by a quarter. Fail. Uh, for fumble. The fumble. My God, this whiskey label is really big if you move it close to your face. <laughs> um, yes, Jeremy, there are a, there are the some sort of creatures with like magic staves and stuff hidden in the mouths of these things as they're marching toward you. Okay, I blow that to rock. Oh, crap. I start looking for a sword. <laughs> There's swords, there's cannons, there's rifles, there's even some pistols. Okay, I got a rifle and a sword. Yay. <laughs> yeah, you wish you could use both at once. That'd really help you out right now. I want a um, rifle sword. Gunplay. Yay. Uh, villains are first. Heroes. Does anybody have a magic item on them? No. no. We Unless the book, the book came with. Uh, it's probably got left in the Australian embassy. It did come with, but it's probably in the... 
destroying a magic item is approved. So, you know, Alex, if you wanted to swivel the cannon over to point in the general direction of the Australian <laughs> embassy and shoot well, it. I don't think Pete would be very happy with that. No, he would not. Um, <laughs> so anyway, yeah, the, the bad guys are pretty much reaching the wall at this point. These are not the normal rounds. These are longer rounds as you guys are doing stuff. Firing cannon. Everybody, oh, you guys can take another fire cannon roll if you'd like just for trying to get a check in cannon. I want to try and hit one of the tall guys in the mouth to, like, so I, I, I'm, I'm hurting myself here. Here we go. I rolled a 98, so that's a fumble. Your cannon explodes, causing massive damage to everybody uh, on the wall, including you, your buddy, and all the furries, possibly the wall itself. Go ahead and roll a D6 plus a D8 for damage for you and uh, Jeremy. Can I attempt to dodge? Uh, sure, you'll get. Uh, I'll knock a D6 off there if you manage to dodge. Success. All right. All right. Here we go. D6 plus D8. Go ahead and roll a D6 plus or a D8 for Jeremy for your yep. own damage. Oh, D8, D8, D8. Six damage. Okay. Um, I don't want to take twelve damage at this point, so you I'm can, gonna. If you spend a pause, you can re-roll those dice. Yeah. Right. Okay. I'm gonna spend a pause and re-roll those dice. Or a hero point. Right. Still twelve. God, <laughs> great. Really I'm taking twelve player. damage. No problem. Uh, the uh, uh, go ahead and roll d six plus a d eight on the wall, Russ. This is general damage for the wall, just so I can get an idea of how fucked up is this wall. Five. It's less fucked up than you are. Great. <laughs> yeah, so, I'm, I'm very fucked up. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. You're you're sitting there bleeding all over the place. There's a lot of dead people and shit. Nobody's blaming you. Cannons blow up from time to time, especially <laughs> if they're fired without without any kind of um, loading or clearing or reheating. It shows out. <laughs> go go go. I love this. <laughs> so yeah. Anyway, I call for a medic. No problem at all. They send the saw bones over to you. <laughs> By the way, just as a quick side note, there is no rapid healing in this zone. This is totally different. So he's going to try a first aid, Old West style. Nice. He spills Ooh. leeches on you and tells you to hold them there until uh, after the battle is done or you die, whichever comes first. And he rushes off to help somebody else. Okay. Next thing around. Can I attempt first aid on myself? Uh, you're in a huge negative if you do. Plus, you've got leeches on you. Okay. Plus, there's not a whole lot of time right now. Is the uh, bad guys, the big ones, and the, all the little ones are up to the wall. The little ones are doing the stack up thing, trying to get over the wall. The big mm -hmm. ones are working on punching the shit out of the wall. Heroes are first, amazingly. Villains get full magic point regeneration. Maneuvers approved. Well, luckily, nothing. Yes. Okay, I'm going to start heading for the inner gate. I don't want to be on this wall anymore. Uh, no problem. You're doing the <laughs> and leaving the big blood trail. All right, give me a, a maneuver roll to or climb either one to get down off the wall and begin uh, hobbling your way to freedom. And Jeremy, what do you do? Uh, does it look like they're going to break the wall by next turn? Uh, you're not really sure. You've never seen these things actually hit a wall. Uh, the soldiers could definitely use some sort of leadership to stiffen their spines. Oh, look, one's already fucking running off. Oh, wait, no, that's, that's rock. Never mind. Uh, 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 I'll roll leadership. Go for it. Uh, you're, you're in a different place entirely there, Alex. You can stiffen their spines and lead them. Yes. Go for it. Maneuvers approved, rock. Oh, that's right. So I made my climb. Oh, and great. I get the car. car. Maybe I'll get the uh, full heal. That'd be lovely. <laughs> that would be wonderful. Steal no, it's a reroll. Steal your spirits, man. Sunny fourth. I got my leadership. I failed right, my eight. leadership. Go for a sallying fourth. No problem. You're you're sitting there going, we will stand and keep this wall. And then you see Rocco. <laughs> you're like, oh, you are totally undermining me right now, Rock. <laughs> So, uh, right, we now go to the bad guys. They begin trying to break through the wall. How do they do? Not well. Right, they're they're pounding on the wall with their fleshy fists and stuff, and the wall is making... And it shows a close-up of um, Alex Kinley's whiskey, and it shows, like, the, the, the rings. Go, do, 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 do. 
do, do, do. He goes, oh, T-Rex. <laughs> so, anyway, we now go to next round. Woo. Villains are first, heroes are second, uh, maneuvers approved. The villains are continuing bashing on the wall, just trying to, no, they're, they're not having a good luck with it. And then you see, Jeremy, one of you, Russ doesn't see us. He is fucking making his way toward the inner wall for all he's worth, trying to hold in his intestines. That's right. He's all fucking attached to them for some reason. <laughs> and you begin to see, Jeremy, the thing uh, near you, its mouth is opening and stuff like that. And you see a guy inside with a fucking bow getting ready to shoot. I, I pick up my pistol and I make a shot at him. Yeah, well, you pick up your pistol at your round unless you got a haste. Uh, I got a fast draw, pist or fast draw pistol. Or, no, I have the rifle. I have you the have rifle, the rifle in your hand already. Yeah, I, I pick up the rifle. That's what I meant to do. Yeah, so and, or, shoot the or, rifle. I'm shooting, shooting the rifle. Shooting the rifle. There you go. Fail. Is that a fumble? Do you have a forty or less than a forty in rifle? I have fifty in rifle. God damn it! It's really hoping that explode. And then you join Russ, and you guys both hold them in your guts. And yeah. Anyway, so uh, Russ, give me a maneuver roll as you're going through the crowded streets. People are. Some kids have grabbed hold of your intestines and are playing fucking uh, jump rope with them and shit. It is not good. All right, I'm gonna try and parkour across these streets. Right now, you're lucky to be <laughs> upright. Intestines hanging out. Yeah. <laughs> am I at full or am I not at full? Uh, yeah, you're you're at full because it's not that exacting of a system. But if you fail, then you may get more damage and fucking kill yourself <laughs> as opposed to just shambling <laughs> through there. All right, I'll just make my maneuver roll. Here we I go. Mean, I, I'm good either way, but uh, you, your character is really fucking wounded, dude. Yeah, I failed my maneuver roll. No problem. The fucking you're in a tug of war with a little girl who was playing uh, jump rope with your intestines and stuff. But eventually, you get it back, little bitch. And so, <laughs> it's my my intestine. You reel it back in. Ah! I should have parkoured. I would have made it. Uh oh, you, you do re you do realize that if uh, you were to take all your intestines and lay them out straight in a line, that you would die. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, next round. The villains are first. Something good happens to them. Uh, the one guy is going to try to uh, shoot somebody. Give me a luck roll there, Jeremy. Let Make it good so he shoots somebody else instead. Hey. He definitely is shooting somebody else instead. He has no idea you're anybody who nobody cares about. Some other dude gets a fucking uh, arrow in him. He goes, can I retreat like the other coward, sir? No. <laughs> Damn it, he says. Attack is approved. So if you can shoot that dude in the mouth who is going to be at a negative 10% because he's got teeth cover. Mm. Uh, yeah, do your damage and take a card. What are you doing, Russ? Uh, I am with rifles, right? making my way through the city again. Is that more maneuver rolls? Uh, either a maneuver or a sprint, or you can just try to steal somebody's wagon or something. I'll just sprint. Okay. What what does damage Crit. what's damage for a rifle? Uh these I believe are D ten. D ten. Critical sprint. Lovely. Um, eight Ooh. damage to the Wow. Face. That guy is really fucked up. He's like, ah, ah. So you get for overlooking me. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, he says. I gotta play immediately. Oh. Oh, Disappearing uh -oh. book. One magical book owned by you goes away. I don't think I have a magical book, so nothing ah. happens. Actually, if you read the card, oh. owned by you. Yeah, I don't keep reading. Me. Keep reading. The player must turn into the GM the book handout as well. Uh, it must have been owned over one week, which we have. The player must turn into the GM the book handout as well, which I don't know what that is. If the player owns no magic books, a random book owned by the group vanishes. That sucks. See? Well, it's a random book. So. Well, yeah. Well, you, uh, how many how many magic books do you own? I will roll between them. Right. So anyway, <laughs> as I said, good well, thing he taught me that spell before I left. Right. 
Right. This is the important thing. You guys have already gotten somebody with the spell. Eventually, all the players will become expert teachers, is my guess. It'll just take some time. <laughs> Not I would. <laughs> Except Alex, mate. Well, I don't know. People may fucking say, hey, Alex, teach me something. Teach me fire magic, Alex. <laughs> no, bugger off. It cuts into my drinking time. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Okay, so uh, the next mega, mega round. Oh, one second. Oh, go ahead. Oh, sorry, Matt. Well, kind of Attack like, is approved. Yeah. Kind of, Did you? Yeah. Fuck's sake. Already taking the call. All right, carry on. Ah, uh, here you are. Um, villains are first. Heroes have a chance of getting knocked down. This only will work if you can successfully quick draw a pistol. One laying down won't really help you, because pistol whipping a foe oh. is approved. Um, yeah. Uh, that <laughs> lieutenant you don't like is in here. <laughs> if you've got a pistol that you can fast draw, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, good. All right. So, um, villains are first. They're trying to knock down the wall first off. Now, the guy in the mouth goes, Singos! Oh, and he begins to swirl. He just drops his bow and arrows. And he begins to swirl his hands at you. And uh, dark necromantic energies are starting to build up around his hands. And nothing else is good is happening there. But he's definitely, uh, he knows you exist now because nobody else has managed to hit that particular guy. They are busy. Everybody else is in a huge fucking life and death fight right now because there are literally hundreds of uh, what appear to be zombies trying to swarm over the fucking walls. Ah, more whiskey! <laughs> <laughs> That's how generals do it. Yes. So uh, what, what are you doing, Russ? You are at the outer gate thing, and it, you're, you're in a bad situation here because... The L-shaped gate, the outside one, it's currently completely jammed up because there's a bunch of uh, citizens trying to take in their livestock, and there's a bunch of soldiers trying to get out, and it has created a fucking stoppage here, the likes of which only my toilet has seen before. <laughs> so the only way that you could actually get in, there are a couple different ways. The only ways I can think of off the top of my head is either parkouring your ass around or using leadership to actually – Free up this thing so that uh, people will will be able to get in and stuff. I'm gonna dance on people's heads. Go for it. Give me a parkour roll. If you fail or fumble, you are fucked. <laughs> All right, you are gonna get trampled by cows and shit like that as you fall down in a month. Uh, I play my reroll card that I have pulled. Damn it! I really wanted to fucking see somebody die from cows. That's good. I got it. Ah, death by cow. Death by cow. Anyway, so uh, right, did you want to be in the outer outer gate or the inner gate? Uh, I don't understand. Take a look at the uh, oh wait, the map. Not the map up. Yeah. Yeah. Let me move that. There. Yep. Okay. See the uh, L-shaped thing. If you were on the brown road going into the big hilly area, the right. first gate you come to is the outer one. Second one's the inner one. Uh, I'm going to the inner one. All right. No problem. You're at the inner one. It is a long fucking slog, by the way. It's pretty much you, the cows, civilians, soldiers trying to get out. And you're probably about halfway through. Looking up, you see there's a lot of cannons and shit that are pointed down here from the fortress. So this okay. is meant to be the killing area for the fortress. But there's a whole bunch of people caught in here because they don't know how to make forts or have stoplights. So okay, yeah, it's not gonna be good. You think you're just hoping that you can get out of here before those cannons start firing and killing everybody. Yep. So we now go to next round. Oh wait, did everybody go on that one? Jeremy, did you uh, didn't get to go? Did you? I, I didn't get to go. Go ahead. Uh, I'm going to shoot necromancer in the head. He doesn't like that. Not one little bit. Holy shit. Yes. Not a crit, but a success. All right. Go ahead and roll your damage. If you get four or more, he is fucking toast. Uh, Rightly wounded just enough uh, that he can try to kill you next round. I kind of want to reroll that just to kill him because I don't want Necromancer juice in my face. Oh, what could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? Can't do worse than a one. I'm going to reroll. Okay. And four then I'm, more. And. Oh. It just shows like <laughs> a little <laughs> bit of his. Wah, 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 wah. He goes, ah, that one will definitely die. 
<laughs> we now go to the next round where you will definitely die. seven boss like I did. <laughs> Ooh, you lucky boy. Kind of. Heroes are first, villains are second, and get reinforcements. Oh. oh the hundreds of thousands of zombies are substantially reinforced. You see more beginning to flood out of the forest. Also, uh, let's see, just for Jeremy, give me a spot hidden roll as you are by yourself getting ready to shoot at this necromancer when suddenly you notice it. <laughs> the walls on either side of you are being overrun and the, the soldiers are forced back. Your guys are still fighting on in this wall, but soon you will be making what they call an island. Uh, and right. the necromancer is still alive, but you get to do something before he dies. Unfortunately, this rifle now requires that you put a new bullet into it for your entire round. <laughs> I hate the Old West at this moment because there's no good <laughs> clips. Yep. <laughs> I got Welcome nothing. Welcome to 1860s. Bolt action know. rifles, yay. <laughs> I guess I jump off the wall or climb down the wall. Retreat. Which you want to do? Jumping, jumping is faster. You yell retreat and jump off the wall. Uh, right, give me a jump roll. If you want to go fast, climb. If you want to go slow. Success at my jump. Yay. Right, no problem. Uh, you jump in there. You see, uh, as you're running through the city streets, you see uh, something explode from under the street, and it kind of forces up part of the street. Next round. Well, don't the villains have to go? Yeah. Or was that they, the oh. villains? Shit, you're right. You were first. Hold on a second. The guy tried to uh, fucking do an evil necromantic spell at your back. Didn't happen. Or he missed. Or you were too quick yeah. for him. And his undead is working on bashing. Ah, oh, you hear the wall crumbling right behind you as you yell retreat and jumped off. Dramatically, it shows you dramatically jumping and fucking bricks and shit are falling down. Yeah. Meanwhile, Russ is fighting with a cow. <laughs> Get out of my way, Bessie. Filthy cow. God damn it, you caused a fire in Chicago. Now get the hell out of the way. Actually, if, if that's all you do this round, Russ, you get a card, because taking a round out to roleplay your insanity has approved this round. I don't know if you have any official insanities, but having a fight with a cow and swearing out like that, I'll give you a card for that shit. <laughs> All right, go I'm, I'm going to try and draw a card, yeah. Great. Matt, what do you do? Uh, gun maintenance. On your best gun, roll a gunsmithing roll or lose it. Fail, fumble on the gunsmithing roll. Cow got it. <laughs> the, <laughs> cow. the cow got my rifle. The cow's got my rifle. That would be the 9mm or the... Oh, no, you don't have your 9mm. No, I don't, but I'm wondering, is that, I don't... Best gun. Best gun, so I lose my, my, my 9 millimeter, right? Cool. Well, yeah. if, 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 if you had it on you, yes. If it's a back oh. at home... It's back at home. Yeah, that'd be rather rifle. cool if the cow was able to pull a 9 millimeter you'd left at home. <laughs> <laughs> that would be fucking epic. The cow's like... And you're like Gangster Arr. cow. <laughs> All right, so Matt, what were you doing this round? Demons. Demons everywhere. Yeah. Risky. Pardon. All right, and Jeremy. Uh, I'm just gonna run away from zombies. Excellent. Give me a run away from zombies roll as they are trying to chase and bite you at the same time. You look back so you can dramatically fall over the only small stone and it's in your way. You look back and go, eh, and fall over. I, I, I kind of want to pause that. I, I don't want zombies if, coming after if me. It, if it's a fumble, I'll have them sweep over you in a dramatic wave and shit. Well, okay. I didn't fumble, but I didn't succeed. All right. You trip over the same stone, but you don't go down this time. You're just stumbling very slowly <laughs> away. And the zombies are like, <laughs> and they're jumping at you and shit. And you're like, I am proper fucked. <laughs> Next round. Oh, as it gets bad. Villains are first. Nothing good's approved. Uh, right. The zombies shuffle after you. Holy fuck, they are shuffling quick as shit. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking film's on fast. If you don't make your sprint roll this round, 
you are going to be captured by zombies and shit. That's how close they are. Do you want to be captured? The cow headbutts you and then gives you two hooves of, from the left. No, um, okay. <laughs> I look down. I see. I believe the cow and try and get behind the gate out of this kill zone. All right, give me a, either maneuver, parkour, something good. All right, parkour. Oh, God Alex, damn what it. are you doing? He's going to probably uh, injure I'll himself. I'll look down, uh, uh, All right, succeed on parkour. I look down Another pause. Yeah? Yeah. Uh, he's, 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 he's like trying just to get away from the zombies, and I'm, I'm like, I bet he didn't do stretches before the combat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and we now go to, to sprint. I'll try and shoot another cannon. I'm pausing that. Oh, I, I got ah. the next round yet. Ah, here we are. Villains at first. Uh, so yeah, let me know how you did. On oh, you failed again. Excellent. Failed. Catch and eat you. Um, <laughs> I, 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 I'm going to pause again. I mean, are you? Bird two paws. I succeeded on that one. Oh, damn it. All right. How'd you do? Okay. And you made your parkour. So you're scaling up on the inner gate. You're out of the kill zone. You're scaling up the wall. By the way, does anybody have medieval fort? Uh, for uh, actually, everybody give me a medieval fortifications roll, please. Cool. Hail. Yeah, go for that check Hail. and learn. Down that check and learn. So, anyway, villains are first. Uh, the zombies attempt to shuffle in high speeds after uh, somebody. Holy Christ, they're right on your heels, dude. You are a fucker. These are the fucking fastest zombies ever. If, if you World War Z zombies. Yeah, yeah, you got World War Z zombies. There's at least a dozen of them right the fuck behind you. The rest of your troops have been completely overrun and shit. You are the sole survivor. It just shows you running with this big fucking black blob of zombies chasing you. <laughs> And you don't know what the fuck's going on. I'm, I'm Brad Pitting uh, it up, man. Yeah, you are Brad Pitting <laughs> it right now. And it's not a happy time for your character. Uh, meanwhile, Mr. I'm holding in my guts is uh, crawling over the wall. Uh, the guard who sees you tries his little sandy roll here. Now it looks like he thought you were a zombie, so he's going to try to fucking push you off the wall. <laughs> now he fumbles and falls off past you. <laughs> Apparently, you, your face distressed him so much he threw himself <laughs> You feel rejected in a way that makes you want to go back and get more of that fucking Smurf semen all over you. Yeah, yeah, I, we had we had it so good in Gargamel's house. I know. Yeah. So, uh, right, and then meanwhile, Alex reading somebody their rights is approved. Mm. All right. So. <laughs> Uh, if you can give me a good enough cannon roll, Matt, uh, then you can shoot some of the ones that are dramatically chasing Phil around. Uh, no, I already wrote them. Ah. All right, no problem. Uh, let me know if you're wanting to shoot the ones chasing Phil because the disadvantage is the disadvantage is if you miss, you're probably going to hit Phil. But for you, that's not a huge disadvantage. So, you know, <laughs> next round. Can I run again? Uh, well, hold on, let's see who's first. Oh yeah, bad guys are first. Stabbing yourself for full damage, including strength bonuses approved. Heroes can only defend this round. No running, only defense. No! no. You turn back and go, no! And the zombie's going, I'm dead. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, you get, you get to defend as a few of them are like leaping onto you and shit, okay? All right. Bink. Oh, luckily you have a loaded roll. <laughs> There's only one that you have to worry about. Give me a defend at negative 30. If you make it, A, you're not going to be eaten. B, you get a card. Which defend, which, what am I rolling against? Uh, I'd recommend you dodge at negative 30 because they're doing right. the leap forward, full body attack while chomping. You don't get a card. Oh, it's defending. Oh, no, you're right. You don't get a card. Sorry, stabbing yourself is approved. If you want to commit some puku, you get a card. <laughs> I, I succeeded at the dodge. Damn, are you sure you wouldn't rather commit some puku and have the zombie bite you? <laughs> right, it would be so cool probably. to commit some puku and get a full heal for that and then just drop the full heal on it. <laughs> hmm. All right. So, uh, yeah, Ross, you're up on the wall. What are you doing in general? I'm getting behind the wall to defend myself. All right. That's all I can do, right? Well, yeah, it, but it's uh, stabbing yourself is approved. 
Oh, hell no. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> I'm, um... You may be able to finish yourself off this round. <laughs> that would fucking wait, 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 wait. Um, you know that that sounds appealing. Um, it will, it will, mm, foil, no. it will foil the people from the college student loan thing that they're not in here. So anyway, don't never, <laughs> expect, <laughs> don't never expect it. Right. Let's see that amazing cannon shot there, Alex. Because next round he's going to need a clear path. Because otherwise he's going to be surrounded by the dead. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He can't attack, though. He can only defend. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, you're fucked. All right. He lines up the cannon and looks defensively at you. Next round. <laughs> heroes first. Yes. Wow. Heroes are first. And hasted. Wow. Nice. Wow. wow. So first off, I'm going to need a maneuver roll for Jeremy to get out of the grips of the dead as they are literally all around you. you I'm, are I'm pausing that. I'm pausing oh, wait, that. Before, before, before. Okay. Okay, hold on. While, you, while you've while you already spent one pause, we'll yeah. worse. Matt, go ahead and shoot some undead if you'd like. Twice, you get two shots at it because you're hasted. So, okay, hold on. Did you say if I miss at all, it's just going to always have to be here. Uh, I, I'll make him make a luck roll negative thirty not to have it hit him. Yeah, I don't think that's really okay. Good idea. I'm sure that you're you're gonna hit what you aim at. Would you like to <laughs> take a shot? Go for it, Matt. I'd prefer to get shot than eaten. What? See? <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> Go, Kinley Brothers! <laughs> No problem. He's he's wiped out several of the zombies and stuff, thus making it so that instead of uh, doing a maneuver, if you want to, because you, if you want to spend an air pause to get rid of that ninety three, yeah, you could you could if you want to do a sprint. I'm, I'm sprinting. Nah, uh -huh. no problem. He manages to kill them off around you, and then um, for your hasted action, do you want to just have a drink, Alex? Or yep. great, uh, yeah. And can I sprint? Oh no, you can only run once per turn. Correct. And give me a free spot hidden, Jeremy. All right. Boom. Success. Remember that really wounded necromancer guy that you didn't finish off? No. <laughs> He's in this fucking huge, like, 100-foot tall undead going, that one there. And it's climbing over the wall and getting ready to punch down at you next round. You're like, motherfucker. So <laughs> I'm pointing at him. Hit that one. <laughs> Everybody around you is in a panic. Next <laughs> round. Uh, villains are first. Yeah, says the giant undead. Defending is approved. Woo, this is your big chance. I recommend dodging as Perry won't do anything. You'll be like, ha ha, and then flat. <laughs> so, right, now is a good time if you would like to try dodging, uh, sir, because the undead is going to try to punch you into paste. Don't forget All right, punch. go for that punch. Yeah, don't forget the five Ds of dodgeball. Oh wow, he so misses. Attempt to dodge it. <laughs> he probably punches himself. Right, his fucking he punches. He misses you, and his fist goes in the ground up to his fucking uh, uh, wrist. And he pulls it back, and the fist is still in the ground, and it goes, and so he's now missing his fucking fist, which is still buried in the ground. And it's looking at its wrist like. That's awkward. And <laughs> you hear a scream of rage from the dude as he, uh, this round, picks up his bow and arrow, like, I'm going to fucking kill him myself. And you're like, ah. So meanwhile, you're on top of the wall. Uh, what do you want to do up there, Russ? It appears that uh, there, there's not really anything good to shoot until it's too late for all the people down there in the big L-shaped thing. Right. And then you can um, shoot into them. Is there the possibility of grabbing a rifle and looking for things that are in range? You can grab a rifle, yeah. Uh, look around. There's, the problem is it's like your wall, all the people that are in the traffic jam that desperately need leadership, other wall. Okay. Can that I, wall is a town. Can I attempt leadership and bark down instructions to the people down trying to get Absolutely through? Absolutely you can. They would love to get some leadership flowing through their veins. <sighs> That's a write-in skill, right? Of course it is. Everything's a write-in skill. Enjoy. Okay. <laughs> nope. You yell incoherently at them. They look Get up. Get your sorry asses in there. Fast, fast. No, not fast enough. You see some little girl <laughs> raise both of her hands and flip you off with both of them at once. 
<laughs> faster, faster, faster! <laughs> What's wrong with you people? And we go to next round as everybody prepares to die due to Russ's poor leadership. Oh, sorry. What, what was Alex doing? I uh, can shot of the big creature. Oh, my God. Go for it. Dun, 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 dun. Ooh. You, you are at a plus 30 because, Cannon, oh, okay. it is huge. Right. Um, by the way, if you're just shooting at the creature in general, as opposed to like in his mouth, yeah, no, no, at no, the no, necromancer, no. something like that, you're at a plus 30 because look how big it is. Yeah, I hit them. Uh, oh, great. Roll, roll an amazing amount of damage, and then you have to do the special roll to see if yeah. it works. What was it again? 2d10. Um, yeah, it sounds right. Yay! Uh, 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 now, <laughs> roll it 3% or less to kill it. Okay, keep track that you've done three damage. Next round, nothing is approved. Villains are first. Guess who's going to shoot his ass? That's right, Jeremy. The guy with the fucking bow leans out of the mouth. If he fumbles, he will fucking fall and probably get stepped on by a sling. He's heavily wounded. He's got blood coming out of his fucking mouth. He's like, he da da da, and he says something in Latin. You speak mm. Latin? Give me a Latin roll. You might. Seems nope. really. Oh, is that? Oh. That's probably a fumble. He that says, is a fumble. I love you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Cupid. Wow, the fucking arrow's like shoom, right next to your fucking head. You're like. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jeremy, what do you do? There, there are soldiers fighting, and I there's some running. pushing in explosives into zombies and lighting it going, well, I'm going to hell. I'm background. sprinting away again. I'm probably, <laughs> am I to the pile of people yet? Not yet. Uh, if you make an amazing sprint roll, you are. I made a 13. Oh. That's, That's pretty amazing. Quarter. You get to the traffic jam. Yay! You say, I'm going to die because of bad leadership. Yay! <laughs> okay. Do, do I get to... Oh, wait. Hold it. We're still in the same round that just blew my leadership, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Don't worry. Well, the villain leadership yeah, the takes a while. took a shot at me, so this is the second round. Mm. This, isn't the next, this is the next round after his leadership fail. Uh, okay. Okay. Do you want to shoot a random civilian and let them know you mean business, Russ? Um, <laughs> no. I will shoot the big thing again. Go if I it. fumble my leadership, though, I'll, I'll happily do that. Oh, good. Plus 30, yes. Right, that's fantastic. 16 plus the three you've done before is 19. Roll 19% or less. Wow, that's a fumble, actually. So... Uh, it is super tough. You need to roll the 19% or less twice in a row. So when you do more damage, then you have to do the destroyer thing twice. Mm -hmm. So villains are first. Uh, he reloads his bow. <laughs> Hitting somebody that chair is approved. There is a chair handy for you, Jeremy, if you wanted a chair. I smack one of the civilians in front of me with a chair. <laughs> oh, <laughs> no. no problem. He attempts to start a riot down there. Jeremy, <laughs> roll me a leadership roll. Maybe this is just what they need. And um, if you draw my card first. Huh? I'm drawing my card first since I smacked somebody. See okay. if the card will come in handy. No problem. Uh, Matt, there are plenty of you chairs. You can't pull it. Oh, the card's not going to work. You it, can't oh, pull. yeah. It's not pulled. Right. What other cards do I have? That's not useful. That's not useful. That is not useful. All right. I, uh, I am uh, going to attempt leadership. Excellent. Bumble. He has started I a riot. Everybody is trying to kill him. No. Everybody's trying to kill me. Isn't that how riots that. work? Just because the, the, the furry people are trying to kill you, as well as the zombies, doesn't make this a bad war. <laughs> uh, I'm going to pause that. That seems like a crit. But, God damn it. Right. He, he <laughs> Apparently, smashing somebody over the head with a chair is just what it needed to get the, the thing moving there. So they're working on that.